All right, hey, Nanagra Christian School, this is James Seifier uh, reporting to you live from my trailer. Um, I'd love to say that I was out on this lake right now, but, uh, but I'm not. I'm in a trailer in my driveway, missing all of you. And uh, I just wanted to uh, touch base, uh, share a couple of updates with you. It's easier than uh, typing it all out in an email. Uh, but just wanted to, to respond to some questions. Uh, first, uh, a big thank you to everybody who came out to our parent town hall the other night. I know not everybody was able to attend, uh, but it was a real great celebration and encouragement to be together. Uh, and yeah, just makes me miss all of you that much more, but, uh, but it was good. Um, just wanted to respond yesterday. If you had watched the news at all, you would have heard that the BC plan to restart our economy. Uh, and we're starting to get a better understanding also of what this is going to mean for schools. Uh, should the number of daily COVID-19 infection rates continue on the tra trajectory that we're currently seeing, um, phase two on the restart plan will include uh, opening of more businesses and workplaces under enhanced protocols, uh, likely after the long weekend. Uh, in the next two weeks, we are really going to look for direction from uh, the Ministry of Education, uh, but what we are anticipating is that uh, school will be expanded for in-person schooling uh, during this time through a phased-in approach. It's going to be voluntary, meaning you do not need to send your kids uh, if you do not feel comfortable doing so. Uh, you can continue with off-site learning uh, for the remainder of this year. But we also want to acknowledge that uh, having kids in school is important, uh, not only for, for children, uh, for their social interaction and development, but also to allow parents to be able to return to the workforce. So we are busy putting in some plans and some frameworks that will focus on the health and safety of staff and of students uh, with expanded in-school, in-person schooling for the remainder of the, the school year. Uh, we, we have a lot of work to do on that. Um, yeah, there's not really a lot of books you can buy on Amazon that are gonna help you uh, map this out in a real clear way. Uh, but we know that we need to look at our safety procedures, hygiene protocols, screening processes for sickness, uh, how we share technology and equipment, what are our cleaning procedures, what does entering the building look like, uh, all of these different things. And so we are, we are working on that um, really hard right now uh, and we'll be able to unveil more of that once we have a bit more time and we hear a bit more from the Ministry of Education on what uh, a phased return to school will look like. Um, you know many of these things that we are working on right now will form our new normal uh, as we are anticipating a full return to school in September. Uh, again, we are expecting more details from the Minister of Education in the upcoming months about the resumption of school in September. But it is being more clear that school life before spring break is going to look different moving forward. However, we will be equipped, we will be prepared, and the, the amazing part of all of this is that we can anticipate being together. Uh, that's been a hard part for me and I know for many of you. So looking forward to, to celebrating on that day. Uh, with the um, expansion of in-person schooling, uh, look for a survey to come out in the next uh, number of days as well, probably in the Sunday weekly email that will just sort of outline what your thoughts and your plans would be for, for your kids. Uh, if you will be sending them back to school, if you feel like um, you're not in a place due to your circumstances where they would not return, um, we just need some input in order to be able to plan uh, appropriately for that. Um, again, if you are, are in a situation where you have been impacted financially in a significant way uh, because of COVID-19, um, I just invite you to apply for our COVID-19 tuition relief. We, we just really want to support and equip our families to uh, be able to continue to be part of our school. Uh, we will also be connecting with every single one of our families in the next number of weeks um, via a phone call. Uh, you'll hear from Amy Gain or Donna Ferris or myself. Uh, we want to check in with you, make sure that you are well. Uh, we want to see if there's things that, that your family needs help or support with. And, and if we're able to help out in certain ways, we would love to be part of that. 
And we just also want to connect with you on what your plans are for September. We know we've done a re-registration process already, um, but things have changed for a lot of people and, and we just want to connect with you about that. So you'll receive a phone call from us uh, and a chance to connect that way. Uh, you'll also see by the end of May, we will uh, let you know what our tuition rates will be and also how to apply for tuition assistance. Uh, our goal is that, that we will not lose any families due to um, worry about what the financial impact is going to be due to COVID-19. Um, so we're anticipating that, we are planning for that, and uh, we would love to talk with you and work with you uh, when those things are released. And um, we're here to, to love your kids and care for your kids. Uh, and we want to just partner with you as families to make sure that uh, we can continue to do what we do and do it really well. Um, it's an amazing community. I feel so encouraged and so blessed to be a part of it. Uh, thankful for all of you and the work that you are doing, uh, whether it's in the workforce or helping kids out at home. Uh, again, as a community serving God, this is our new beautiful work. And together we will do it well. We will bring glory to God. We will give thanks to God. And we will get through all of this together. Uh, so looking forward to the day where uh, we will celebrate and we will celebrate well. Thanks to Nama Christian School. See you soon.